Greetings, pilots! Jet Squirrels are back with a new episode of Developer Diaries. The nearly endless summer is upon us, and it brings a truly huge update 2.0.5. Let's dive right into the details. Greetings! With update 2.0.5, World of Warplanes will see significant changes. We have new opportunities for developing your aircraft and improving its characteristics. Let's talk about them in more detail. This update is the first stage towards implementing an extended progression or level-up system. Previously, you could use experience earned in battles on upgrading your aircraft and advancing to Tier 10. But now you will have new opportunities. You will be able to develop each aircraft even further by giving it new properties and emphasizing its strengths. All equipment will be changed in Update 2.0.5. It can now be mounted only in special slots. For example, if an aircraft has a slot for equipment that improves the cockpit, you can mount a sight or armor in this slot. If an aircraft has an equipment slot for the engine, you can mount an upgraded engine or armor protection for it. Now equipment has a significant positive effect and a slightly negative one. For instance, to increase maneuverability, you will have to sacrifice a small number of hit points. But the most important thing is that now you can change and improve equipment to meet your own needs. For this purpose, we are introducing equipment enhancement and calibration. Enhancement increases the equipment's quality level. There are four quality levels – Stock, Improved, Advanced and Ultimate. Each new level increases the number of positive effects of the equipment. For example, a stock optical sight increases only the firing accuracy, but its enhancement can add a chance of causing fire, a chance of inflicting critical damage and other effects. Calibration can increase the positive effects of equipment or weaken the negative ones of any quality level. Thanks to calibration, you can improve the advantages to the maximum extent. Both enhancement and calibration require special materials. You can receive them by destroying aerial and ground targets in victorious battles. With the release of the update, a special will start that will familiarize players with all the new features and will offer an opportunity to try the new equipment. Elite status is no longer the final stage in aircraft development. Now you will be able to complete a special mission and reach the specialist configuration for your favorite aircraft. The mission objective is easy and, in fact, will gradually fulfill itself if you just continue to fly the selected aircraft. The specialist configuration differs from the stock one in the significantly greater number of slots for equipment and consumables. By mounting them and combining their effects, you can significantly increase certain characteristics of your aircraft and thus adapt it to the specific missions and playstyles that are more to your liking. Depending on the type and tier, aircraft can have a different set of slots for equipment and consumables. Starting from version 2.0.5, low and mid-tier aircraft in the stock configuration will have a smaller number of such slots. Here's an example of how the new features can be used. A Tier 6 fighter in the stock configuration has one slot in the cockpit and one in the airframe. You can increase the damage ability of your aircraft by mounting a collimator sight in a lightweight wing frame and thus increase its firing accuracy and maneuverability. Or you can do it the other way. Increase survivability by using cockpit armor and reinforced skin that will increase the aircraft and pilot's resistance to critical damage. The specialist configuration will add another two slots, one for an engine and the other for an airframe. You can continue to make your aircraft more aggressive and improve the airspeed, or you can additionally protect these modules from critical damage and thus transform your aircraft into a flying tank. As a result, you will be able to create builds, combine equipment and consumables so that a certain characteristic of your aircraft and playstyle will become much more prominent. 
Unlike the stock configuration, the modules of an aircraft in the specialist configuration cannot be changed. A specialist is equipped with the top configuration for its model. If you wish, you can switch to the stock configuration and back to choose what is more important for you, an opportunity to mount more equipment or change modules. In addition, you can now acquire elite status just by researching all modules of an aircraft. You don't need to research the next aircraft in the tech tree. You can accelerate crew training or start earning free experience at once. Update 2.0.5 is just the first step in introducing the new progression system. Future updates will bring new configurations for legendary aircraft and significantly different module compositions, which will even change the role of some aircraft in battle. The game will see new equipment and consumables, as well as changes to the aircraft's exterior. All this will allow you to fly your favorite aircraft exactly the way you like. Pilots, start your engines! See you in the skies!